Welcome to our tutorial on how to create a virtual disk, also known as a virtual flash drive. A virtual disk is a convenient way to allocate storage space on your computer without the need for additional hardware. Let's get started. Open Disk Management. Press the Windows key plus X on your keyboard and select Disk Management from the Power User menu. In Disk Management, click on the Action menu and choose Create VHD. Choose the location where you want to create the virtual disk file. Click the Browse button to select a folder. Type the file name that you want, example, My Virtual Drive. Then Save. Specify the size of the virtual disk in MB, GB, or TB. Make sure it doesn't exceed the free space available on your physical drive. Select the format of the virtual disk. We recommend using VHDX as it offers better performance and features compared to the older VHD format. Decide on the virtual hard disk type. You can choose between fixed size or dynamic. Fixed size allocates all space up front, while dynamic grows as you add data. Dynamic disks are more space efficient. Click OK button. The new virtual disk will appear in disk management as unallocated. Right-click on it and select Initialize Disk. Choose the partition style, either MBR for disks under 2 terabytes or GPT for larger disks, and click OK. Right-click on the unallocated space of the virtual disk and select New Simple Volume. Follow the on-screen instructions to create a new partition on the virtual disk. Click Next. Click Next again. Then Next. Then type the name of the virtual drive on the volume label. Example, My Virtual Drive. Then click Next. Then Finish. Once the partition is created, it will appear as a new drive in File Explorer. You can now start using it just like any other disk drive. If you want to eject the virtual drive, you can do so by right-clicking on it and selecting Eject. To attach the virtual drive, simply locate the virtual file that we created earlier and then double click on it. The virtual drive will now be mounted and accessible. Furthermore, you have the option to copy the virtual drive, along with the files saved on it, to another location, storage device, or computer. Congratulations! You've successfully created a virtual disk on your computer. Virtual disks are a great way to manage your storage needs efficiently. If you found this tutorial helpful, don't forget to like and subscribe for more tech tips. Thank you for watching.